Six days ago, I started a brand new YouTube shorts page, scripting the videos completely with AI, and the results have been amazing so far. 80.1% of people stayed to watch this video, and the retention is damn near 100% throughout. Then on this video, similar story, 78% of people stayed to watch the vid, and the retention is pretty much flat throughout the video. I'm going to show you how I script these videos completely with AI, so you can start doing it too. But first things first, if you want swipe rates and retention like this, do not use ChatGPT. I've tried ChatGPT for scripts and the results are absolutely terrible. ChatGPT is like the lowest level AI script writer out there. It is borderline rubbish when it comes to script writing. Instead, there are so many far better options that can actually give you quality scripts if you know where to find them. So we are going to be using this instead and I've tested it myself and the results have been fantastic. We are going to follow the pre-hook question deliver approach and this has been done by Mr. Beast, Airac, Ryan Trahan and so many top YouTubers and even faceless YouTubers in this space as well. The pre-hook starts by showing something interesting that captures the viewer's attention. For example, Air Rack is showing a massive 7-Eleven cup that gets your attention as soon as you see the video. Then the question. This part actually asks a question within the shorts. Let's see if they fill it up is what Air Rack asked to get the viewer to follow along with the video so they know what to expect. And then of course Deliver actually answers on the question in the video. So you show the pre-hook to get the viewer enticed, a question to keep them going and then deliver on that question and end the short straight away. This is a golden approach you should be using to script any YouTube shorts. But I appreciate still some people don't really know how to script. So I'm going to show you an AI that can do this for you. And this is the entire content process I've been using for that brand new shorts page. Volo for ideation, Poppy AI for scripting, 11 Labs for the voiceover, and CapCut for editing the videos. So this is Poppy AI, the magical AI script writer I've been using to make all these short form videos. And it can generate 50 scripts in literally less than 10 minutes. Now, why this is better than ChatGPT is because ChatGPT, you feed it a prompt and it gives you answers, but you don't give it any basis to work off of. Poppy AI, on the other hand, you feed it the top performing videos in your niche, give it a little example of what you want, and it will give you results catered to what you are after. You can check out Poppy AI by the link in the description and in the pinned comment to sign up with my special coupon code. And not just that, I've got a surprise for you. Anyone that uses Poppy AI, I've made this exact board public. So you can copy this exact board I'm doing, sub in your niches, and you can start generating scripts straight away for your YouTube channel. So let's start with this part up here. This is the user content examples. These are the good quality scripts in your niche that you're going to feed to Poppy AI. So no matter what niche you are in, you are looking for videos that got millions of views so you can sub them into Poppy. So you can add the YouTube button, enter the URL and drag it in. How I found my videos was from Verlo AI, a tool that I co-founded that shows you the most popular videos in different niches. So let's say I'm in the motivational niche. I would scroll down and click on motivation within the Verlo niches. Then I would select on one of the days where popular videos have been posted. For example, March the 21st. I would find a video that matches the niche I'm after. For example, this one by Pearl Doc. I would click on it and then copy the link. Then when I go over to Poppy AI, I can click on TikTok on the left hand side and then paste in this URL to add the video to my Poppy board. If I now drag this video within user content examples, Poppy AI would use the script and format of this video to base my scripts off of. Now, of course, I'm not within this niche. I'm in celebrity news, as you can see right here. I already added my popular videos, but if I was in this niche, it would be perfect. So your job is to populate this section with five to six good examples from your niche of videos that have got at least millions of views, if not 10 million views. Once you've got your user content examples, let's scroll down and look at the offer and ICP information. This tells Poppy AI what you are after. So for me, it's super high retention scripts that hook the viewer with a question and then delivers throughout the short. This follows the format I was talking about earlier with the pre-hook question and deliver. And on the right hand side, I gave a little description as to what Poppy AI should be doing. So I called it an expert content strategist that writes titles and scripts according to user content examples and the offer and ICP information. I also made it clear that the scripts need to be between 90 and 120 words because that is roughly 45 to 60 seconds long as required in YouTube shorts. As I mentioned before, I already shared this board publicly on Poppy AI so you can start using it straight away. I only recommend that you sub out these user content example videos for videos based on your particular niche. And so once you've done that, all you need to do is now type into the chat prompt, generate me a viral idea and a script. And as you can see, Poppy AI created a viral idea and script based on the prompts. So of course my niche is celebrity stories. So you can see right here, when KSI met I show Speed's sister, the title is generated and the script as well. What I would then do is omit this part about subscribing for more, but I would copy all of this and paste it into 11 Labs. Now I've got an 11 Labs Pro subscription, so I'm able to use custom voices like Mark 
but you can use someone generic like Josh or Adam. And if anyone is interested, these are the settings I use for my voiceovers when it comes to Eleven Labs. Then all I need to do is click generate speech and the video is created for me. Did you know KSI accidentally exposed iShowSpeed's sister during their collab stream? Did you know iShowSpeed almost got permanently banned from streaming last month? During his 24-hour live stream, Speed was playing Fortnite when a fan donation triggered his fire alarm prank. In a panic, Speed jumped so hard he broke his chair and accidentally flashed his personal information on screen. His phone started blowing up with calls from unknown numbers while he was scrambling to end the stream. The craziest part? His manager had to drive to his house at 3 a.m. to help him secure his accounts. Speed later revealed he lost access to his bank account for 48 hours and had to change all his passwords. This isn't even the first time. Remember when his Ronaldo reaction almost got him in serious trouble? Now when it comes to editing, like I mentioned before, you can use CapCut to edit it all together for free and there's plenty of YouTube tutorials on doing that. I'm not an expert editor myself and in fact I've hired someone to edit the videos for me so they are top quality but this is an option for free for those of you that don't want to pay for an editor. And if you keep doing that consistently you will get a channel blow up. As I said I've posted six videos so far and already I'm starting to see an increase in views accumulating 100,000 in the first six days alone. And like I mentioned before with Poppy AI all I then prompt is another one and another script and idea is generated for me and I can keep doing this multiple times to create multiple different scripts. Literally created 50 viral scripts in like 15 minutes. That is the power of using a good quality script generator when it comes to your YouTube shorts. If you're using ChatGPT or clean them yourself, you're leaving a massive gap for errors, whereas this script generator literally bases the content of already popular videos. And Poppy AI is not just good for short form videos as well. I've used it myself on ultra long form content. And if you want to see exactly how, make sure you check out the video right beside me.